in YouTube land. Another evening with the Real American Cougar. We're going to talk about the pursuit of happiness. Uh, we've been talking about creating our own life and creating our own happiness for quite a while now. And But what really is happiness? Uh, it's different things to different people. It's a pretty deep subject. But uh, do you remember when you were really, really, truly happy? I mean, we all have some memories of being happy. Um, but when everything felt just right and calm and peaceful, um, I don't have too many memories of that. So that's why I've been working on creating my own life and creating my own happiness now that I'm older, because I made quite a few mistakes uh, in thinking that I would be happy. Sometimes we put off creating our happiness because we think, well, uh, when I find someone, then I'll be happy. When I buy a house, then I'll be happy. When I get the job that I want, then I'll be happy. Uh, but it, we're happy at first. When we get these things, we're happy at first, and it seems nice, but then it uh, seems like later on, Things uh, come and go and work out one way or the other way, and we still have the house, we still have the car, we still have the job, but we don't still have the happiness. So we got to take a lot of responsibility in order to make our own happiness. Um, I made that mistake lots of times. I always was waiting for the day when this would happen or that would happen, and I would be happy. And we waste a lot of time doing that. I know I wasted a lot of time. Um, I, then I finally decided that it was time for me to create my own happiness and be happy. So you're in charge of your own happiness. I think that everyone deep down inside, uh, an arrested mind, an arrested soul, an arrested body, uh, I think is just uh, naturally wanting to feel happy and naturally happy. Um, I don't think anybody is ever born to be sad all their life, uh, to be mean all their life. You'll come across some people that don't seem very happy. Uh, I don't understand what their circumstances are, but they must have a, a terrible, terrible life to look forward to. So working on um, my own happiness has been a big priority for me for the last couple of years. Um, once, a lot of times when we think we're lacking something, and trying to get something or we're struggling to get something that we want out of life or get something, um, it's not really being happy. Um, you might be happy when you get it, but the more you look at what you're lacking, most of the time I found the more that I look at what I'm lacking or what I might not have as nicely as someone else, or someone might be just luckier than I am, or have more money than I do, or be prettier than I am, uh, that's setting yourself up to be unhappy. Um, comparing yourself to others does not always make you happy. Very rarely does it make you happy. So the first thing to do is to just accept yourself the way you are. Um, you're alive, you're breathing, you're able to walk the earth and do the things that you want to do when you can. There's a lot to be happy about, even if you had a little shack out in the middle of nowhere, sitting by a wood stove, eating up your whatever you can find to eat, and you're alive, you know, you can still be happy. You don't have to be bustling and going here and going there. It all starts inside of you. So we need to take a good look at our own selves, examine our own selves, which is pretty scary. It's pretty scary to take a look at your own self and decide if you're going to be happy, how you're going to do it. Um, sometimes you got to make some changes on yourself. The first thing to do is accept yourself that the way you are. Um, the more I thought that I was different from other people, the more I thought that my life wasn't as great as other people's, the more unhappy I was. So I had to turn to my own self and I had to go through my own emotions and, uh, my own feelings, my own situation, and figure out what is really the reason that I'm happy. And I can say the reason I'm happy is because I enjoy my own company. I don't have to be the center of attention. I don't have to be out with people. I don't always have to be going here or going there. I can sit home and be by myself and be happy. Um, I can do enjoy my own company. 
I'm present in as many moments of life as I can be. If I'm outside around my home or uh, I'm out somewhere, I like to look around and I like to see the colors. I like to feel the air. I like to uh, smell the smells. I like to uh, take my time. Some days if I'm out doing errands or something, I just don't care what time I get back. I have all day to do it. And um, be present in every moment that you possibly can and experience every moment that you possibly can. Take it in um, and you get, become calm and you have an inner peace that helps toward your happiness. Laugh, sing, be goofy. If you want to goof off, if you're in your own home, you want to throw on the music, you want to dance around, you want to do something goofy, you want to talk to your pets and maybe pretend that they answer you. You know, do that. Do whatever it is that makes you happy yourself. Um, lacking something isn't going to lead us to happiness. It's always going to make us feel inferior. So we want to be happy with what we have, while we have it, and what we're doing at the time. Uh, you find that if you search yourself and you find that um, you are okay in your environment, you can exist in your environment, uh, you do have love of your family and other people, friendship, we need to be grateful, we're talking talk about the gratefulness, we had a little talk about that before, the gr more grateful you are for what you have, and you will see how much you really do have, that's going to add to your happiness a lot too. Uh, get your emotions in line. Uh, we talk about, I talk about the inner critic that's always telling us, well, you don't have this, or you don't have that, or you don't look like that, or you don't weigh uh, 20 pounds less, or whatever. Um, that's not going to do a whole lot for our happiness. So we've got to build up our own confidence. Confidence is a superpower. Confidence gets you where you need to go. So even if you aren't confident, if you act as if you're confident, uh, that's where you search yourself and find out what it is you actually want out of life and where you're really going and what really makes you happy. Sometimes happiness is going out and getting an ice cream, even by yourself. I love to go to Barney's and get an ice cream at Boxcar Barney's. I'll go by myself and I'll sit there and I'll eat ice cream and I'll be happy. We can make our own happiness. It comes from a sense of self-confidence and a purpose in life. Uh, sometimes you're not happy because you just don't know what to do with yourself. Um, being lonely makes people happy, but if you find that you have an interest, uh, you're happy with your own self-image, you're happy with your own uh, situation, you're not looking to get more, 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 you're able to exist with what you have and appreciate what you have, appreciate yourself, look at your good qualities, we all have them, bring out your own good qualities and look at your good qualities. Uh, decide what you're going to be uh, responsible for and what you're not. Sometimes we take on responsibilities that we really don't need to, or we take on the blame from things that really doesn't belong to us or the guilt that really doesn't belong to us. So search yourself at home. Uh, search your emotions. Find out what feelings you need to keep and which ones you need to throw out. Uh, that's going to help your happiness. But find your purpose. Find your purpose and do it with confidence. Um, don't ever, ever rely on someone else to make you happy because it is totally your responsibility and your work to do to keep yourself happy. Um, as long as you turn inward and see what you need to do to help yourself, uh, like we said, love yourself, take care of yourself, you'll find that happiness comes along a lot easier. So that's my little tip for tonight. Um, we want to pursue happiness. We want to start with ourselves. We want to be happy and acceptable of our own self. We want to uh, accept how we feel. Our feelings are real. If we want to laugh, we can laugh. If we want to cry, we can cry. Please don't expect and wait for something to come to make you happy because you're going to waste a lot of time that you could be happy while you're waiting for something else. So I'm happy you tuned in. I'm happy you're watching. I'm happy for all those who like and subscribe and share. So think about your own happiness. Take a few moments and sit down and look at yourself and decide what really makes you happy in life and go for it. Peace out.